Hello everyone, let's start with exercise 3.3. So here I am going to start with question number 9, fifth part. So it says 43x plus 67y equals minus 24 and the other equation is 67x plus 43y equals 24. So now you need to use one trick here that is you need to mark equation 1. This is my equation 1 and second is this. Now you need to first add these equations, then you need to subtract these equations. Then we will get to another equation and from there you can get the value of x and y. So let's start with it. So first step is we need to add 1 and 2. And remember when you are adding, you need to add the left hand side with left hand side and right hand side with the left, right hand side. So 43x plus 67y plus 67x plus 43y equal minus 24 plus 24. So here we are with 43x and 67x so it will be 110x and the another one will be again 110y equals minus 24 plus 24 so it will be 0. This is my equation number. One. Now I can simplify this further. How? What you can do is you can take 110 common from the left hand side. So it will be 110 into x plus y equals 0. So now you need to bring 110 to the right hand side. So it will be x plus y equals 0 over 110. And 0 over any number is 0. So this is my equation number 1. This is my final equation number 1. Now we need to find equation number 2 and for that what you need to do is you need to subtract second from 1. Second from 1 will be 67x sorry 43x then we have 67y minus 67x plus 43y equals minus 24 minus 24. So it will be 43x minus 67x. So it will be minus 24x. And 67y it will be minus 43y. So 67 minus 43 is positive 24y equals minus 48. Now you can see that from left hand side we can take common is 24. So taking 24 out we are left with minus x plus y equal minus 48. Now let me write this again here minus x plus y equal minus 48. Now I need to bring 24 to the right hand side and it will be divided here. So minus x plus y equal minus 48 over 24. So it will be minus 2 here. So this is my equation number 2. So we are given with equation number 1 and we are given with equation number 2. So let's use elimination method here. So x plus y equals 0 and minus x plus y equal minus 2. Now what we need to do we need to subtract these two values here to get the value of y and x. So subtracting this we get we can reduce y and y so it will be 0 here x plus x it will be 2x and we have 2 on the right hand side. So 2x equals 2 so x will be 2 over 2 it will be 1 now. Now we need to find the value for y. So using equation number 1 we have x plus y equals 0, x is 1, 1 plus y equals 0, y equals minus 1. So y is minus 1, x is 1. So that's your answer for question number 9, fifth part. Thank you for watching this video.